Johnny Depp's brief cameo at the VMAs was embraced by some, but it's stirring up outrage as well, specifically from Amber Heard's sister, who went in on MTV. Whitney Enriquez posted a screenshot of MTV's award show logo, but she placed a threatening letter at the front, a big capital D. So now on Whitney's page, it reads DVMA, which alludes to domestic violence. She writes, MTV, you're disgusting and clearly desperate. I really hope that none of the people that made this call have daughters. But Deb fans were quick to react to Whitney's post, especially after it emerged that she was also one of her sister's victims. So is Amber still using Whitney to spread propaganda that suits her narrative? Let's find out more. Amber Heard's sister Whitney Enriquez is slamming MTV for featuring Johnny Depp in the 2022 Music Video Awards, just under three months after the verdict in the Virginia defamation trial. During the Sunday Night Live broadcast, Depp appeared as the award show Moon Person in a pre-recorded bit with his face digitally superimposed into the helmet of the floating figure. He told the audience at one point, and you know what? I needed the work. While hovering inside the Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. And you know what? I needed the work. In a joint post between his Instagram account and MTV's official page, a clip of the moment was shared with the caption, guess who? Hashtag VMAs. Depp's former lawyer, Adam Waldman, the subject of Amber's three defamation countersuit claims, which she won one of and was awarded $2 million in damages, commented on the post with a celebratory raising hands emoji. But it seems not everyone was excited to see Depp back on the big stage. Following the surprise inclusion of the Oscar nominee in the show, 34-year-old Whitney reacted on her Instagram story, sharing the message, I stand with Amber Heard, and a graphic that renamed the event the DVMAs, a seeming reference to domestic violence. Deb, whose face appeared to be superimposed in the spacesuit, could be heard in a voiceover saying, I just want you guys to know that I'm available for birthdays, bar mitzvahs, bat mitzvahs, weddings, wakes, any old thing you need. I just want you guys to know that I'm available for birthdays, bar mitzvahs, bat mitzvahs, weddings, wakes, any old thing you need. Alluding to his drama with his ex-wife and Whitney's older sister Amber, that he claims caused him to lose out on film roles, the embattled actor joked, and you know what? I needed the work. Amber's sister Whitney wasn't the only one that took issue with the bit. As one person raged on Twitter, MTV is so disgusting for this Johnny Depp sh while another wrote, man, F MTV for giving Johnny Depp a platform. All these people are believed to be sponsored by Amber. The MTV Video Music Awards appearance was Depp's first major sighting on US television, since he was a guest in 2017 on the Jimmy Kimmel Live talk show. Depp made a few appearances throughout the award show broadcast from the Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. VMAs, let's get back to the effing music, shall we? He also said at one point from the spacesuit, during the Virginia trial, Whitney allegedly confessed that the Rum Diary star severed her ex-husband's finger. Unreleased pre-trial court documents reveal that Whitney told her boss about the 2015 Australian fight between Depp and Amber when the mother of one cut the Edward Scissorhands star's finger. During the highly publicized defamation trial of the former Flames that lasted for six weeks, Depp testified that Amber threw a liquor bottle at him during their fight, which left the tip of his finger cut off. However, the actress vehemently denied the allegations while testifying in court that Depp hurt his own finger when he smashed a wall-mounted phone and later sexually assaulted her with a vodka bottle. But the unsealed court documents include a transcript of a deposition from a former employer of Whitney, Jennifer Howell, in which she said that Whitney allegedly got a message from Amber about the bombshell Australia fight. She just screamed, she's done it now. She's cut off his goddamn finger and made this huge proclamation. And I pushed my chair back. I was like, what? Howell told Depp's lawyer, Camille Vasquez. And she goes, she cut off his finger. She cut off his finger. And then she bolted out the door and was like, I got to call somebody. I got to call somebody, Howell added. So when Whitney is now bashing Depp and calling him names, it only shows who is the hypocrite between the two. But one thing is clear. She is acting under the instructions of her elder sister. Remember, this information is based on theories and opinions and therefore shouldn't be considered facts. And that's it from us today. Until next time, bye!